Welcome, dear viewers, to another insightful video. Before we dive into today's topic, let's take care of a little housekeeping. If you haven't already, we encourage you to subscribe to our channel, hit the like button, and turn on notifications. This ensures you never miss our updates on important discussions like the one we're about to embark on. We appreciate your support, and your engagement helps us to continue providing content that matters. Now that we're all set, let's get started with the video. Today, we're going to explore a topic that affects most of us, yet remains largely unspoken, the impact of social media on mental health. Buckle up, because this is going to be an enlightening journey. Has it ever crossed your mind that the very tool you use to connect, share, and explore could be the one chipping away at your mental health? It's a heavy question, but one that a recent survey by the United Kingdom's Royal Society for Public Health set out to answer. The survey, aptly named Hash Status of Mind, gathered input from nearly 1,500 young individuals aged between 14 to 24 across England, Scotland, Wales, and Northern Ireland. Participants explored how different social media platforms impacted 14 different aspects of their mental and physical health. The results were quite revealing. Of the five social networks included in the survey, Instagram was found to be the worst for mental health and well-being. Despite receiving points for self-expression and self-identity, it was significantly associated with high levels of anxiety, depression, bullying, and the fear of missing out or FOMO. In contrast, YouTube received the highest marks for health and well-being, being the only site to score a net positive rating by respondents. Twitter, Facebook, and Snapchat followed, leaving Instagram trailing behind. But it's not all doom and gloom. The survey did highlight some benefits of social networking. All platforms received positive scores for self-identity, self-expression, community building, and emotional support. YouTube even received high marks for raising awareness of other people's health experiences, providing access to trustworthy health information, and decreasing respondents' levels of depression, anxiety, and loneliness. However, the negative aspects can't be ignored. All platforms received negative marks for affecting sleep quality, promoting bullying, fostering poor body image, and inducing FOMO. Unlike YouTube, the other four networks were associated with increases in depression and anxiety. The Hash Status of Mind report highlights the compare and despair attitude that social media can foster. Seeing friends constantly on holiday or enjoying nights out can make young people feel like they are missing out while others enjoy life. This may also explain why Instagram, where personal photos are the centerpiece, received the worst scores for body image and anxiety. The Royal Society is now urging social media companies to take action, recommending the introduction of a pop-up, heavy usage warning within these apps or websites. This is something that 71% of survey respondents said they would support. They also advocate for measures to highlight digitally manipulated photos and identify users who could be suffering from mental health problems. In summary, while social media platforms do have their benefits, it's crucial to be aware of their potential negative impact on mental health. With the right measures in place, we can hopefully navigate these digital spaces in a healthier, more positive way. We hope you found this video informative. We'd love to hear your thoughts on the impact of social media on mental health. Your engagement helps us create better content and fosters a healthy conversation about these important issues. Don't forget to leave a comment below and share your own experiences or tips for maintaining a healthy relationship with social media. We're always working on producing more videos like this one to help you navigate the digital world in a healthier, more positive way. To make sure you don't miss out on any of our future content, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, hit the like button if you found this video helpful, and turn on notifications so you'll be the first to know when we upload a new video. Thank you for watching and for being a part of our community. We appreciate your support and look forward to continuing to provide you with informative and engaging content.